Douglas County Health Center also confirms its first two cases. Investigators think that the residents contracted the virus from a staff member. KETV Newswatch 7's Delon Dillard is live with that and the warning to long term care providers. Delon. Julie, we've heard the requests from the pub for the public to isolate and practice safe social distancing, but tonight county and city leaders are specifically warning long term care providers to stay out of the public during this crisis. Individuals who have work in long term care facilities, honestly, I hope I do not see one single one of them in the community going to a grocery store. A strong rebuke from Douglas County Health Director Dr. Adi Poor. Her message comes as two long term residents test positive for COVID 19 at the county's health center. Health investigators believe the residents caught it from a staff member taking care of them. Usually the residents, they don't go out, they don't go around. So how are they going to be infected? By a staff member bringing it in the facility. We've learned the staffer in question didn't even know he was showing any symptoms of coronavirus. This was in fact picked up on a routine temperature screening as he was coming in. He had no idea. The employee is in isolation as he awaits test results. Health officials say the two residents are women in their 70s and 80s. Both are stable tonight and isolated in their own private rooms. We have taken strict precautions. Um, we immediately went to face mask as soon as the CDC guided us there on the 20th of March. And so right now everyone is using face mask and appropriate PPE throughout the building. Leaders ask the public to follow public restrictions, saying it's crucial to stop the spread of the virus. All of you, please take this to heart and let's practice this because it works. So leaders also tell me every staff member working there is screened daily. And at this time, they don't believe any other employees or residents could be at risk.